Hi everybody, my name is Ivica, thank you so much for being on my latest Let's Play video from my series Apex Legends Beginner's Hell. It's going to be a tips and tricks video this time, I know what you're saying, you have no clue about this game, but trust me, I have some clue. Before we get into these tips, I have a huge shout out for a super cool FPS gamer and an excellent gameplay gaming creator. The channel in question is called Scuffy Golem 196 You can find links to his YouTube and Twitch channels in the description below. If you're into FPS games, it's well worth your time. This guy is super talented, super fast, super efficient, super good in FPS games, unlike me. So give him a look and like, share, subscribe if you like it, of course. Now, let me choose Gibraltar because I can choose my Bangalore, but never mind. And to end my shout out, if you like first like first person shooters, you're gonna love Scruffy Golem 196. I can't say it any simpler. Now with that, let's get into this tips and tricks videos. I'm going to go and play a single game where I'm going to show you some early game ideas that I use as a super huge complete beginner that really helped me to stay alive long enough to suck. Unless uh, you use these or some version of these, you're gonna probably suck but super fast and die immediately. Now the most important tip, don't jump inside of the drop zone, the same drop zone we're dropping right now. So this is a big mistake and you're going to see why, but I'm going to keep with it because we're immediately going to get into some kind of a match, some kind of a fight and I have no loot. So that would be my second tip. Loot as fast as you can and get any kind of a weapon because without it you'll be dead in seconds. I'm going to be dead in seconds in any way probably, but at least this way I'm going to have something to fight back. Uh, there are no loot elements here. I'm going to pick them up just as fast as I can. My co-players are already engaged in a match, but I need to get an armor. They're already fighting, they're already killing and dying. I have two guns and uh, Havoc is going to be the one I choose. So, as I said, early game, don't drop in the... Uh, trajectory of the dropship and the second is loot and get any weapon as fast as possible. Uh, so the third uh, kind of advice would be stick with your team, which we're not doing that well at this present point. And somebody shooting, I don't know why, but uh, let's see who it is or where the same enemy might be located. Uh, still, I do have weapons, but I don't have any armor. Um, fourth tip would be to move and move fast. Uh, this weapon is good, as any weapon is, if you don't have any other. But as a wise man said to me a long time ago, Apex Legends is a game that's more about, alrighty, that's what we're after. It's a game that's more about movement than shooting, so you need to shoot, move and slide, especially if you're going downhill, uh, not just like in your game, but actually uh, <laughs> when it comes to uh, your physical movement in the map or on the map. Uh, again, we're pretty split up here and not close together at all. Uh, let's see if I can see anybody here. No. Alrighty, there's another cool rare armor. And yeah, let's keep on moving. So for our early game, even though we did drop in a really ridiculous part of the map, it's not bad so far, I'm still alive, all of my teammates are alive, they're shooting at somebody, but I'm not uh, sure certain where or who. Uh, I'm going to switch weapons, and I'm going to uh, 
keep up with my co-player, with my teammate, hoping for the best. Let's cover the other side. So somebody was here clearly looting all the way. Uh, we're moving through the drainage pipe. And let's see. Yeah, we can say that we need to loot around here. I need some heavy, uh, heavy ammo and energy ammo as well. Heavy rounds, that's pretty cool. And I can drop things I don't need here. Okay. That's basically it. No enemy there. Also, this is something that happens all of the time, especially if you're playing the people who are not really great at the game, which is not that small of a number, including me, uh, is that you get a lot of false pings. Uh, somebody already dropped here. And there's nothing to be found or had. Let's see where the ring is. We're well inside of the ring. Uh, my prowler has no upgrades which is also a big problem uh, because my Havoc only has a sight with some really abysmal uh, zooming uh, capability which also sucks and now we're in a mid, mid game kind of a point where hopefully I can do some damage but there is also a big chance of me not doing anything here and just dying because mid game is not something I do well. Uh, my co players found something. Okay, not for long. <laughs> okay, care package is somewhere here. So, okay. They're shooting at me, they're, yeah, the enemy is here, so let's see if I can change this for... Oh. For a target, no target here. Okay, I have no time to do anything except to revive my co-player. And I'm going to die while doing this. And yeah, that happened. And it was a complete disaster. Although somebody killed me with 73 points of damage, uh, 73 kills, uh, which is bad. And uh, bad for me, but not for the same person. You can see we survived plenty but we failed in our first firefight. Thanks to me, in part, but also thanks to the rest of us. I should have went go, I sh should have, shouldn't have went for the revival there, but still, hopefully you get something useful, at least out of the early game talk. So, my advice would be, drop away from the path of the dropship. Loot your weapons, and your armor as fast as you can and then follow your co-players while moving all of the time because the game is more about movement than damage dealing also don't suck like, like me don't suck uh, superbly like I did as you can see kills zero damage done zero revive allies zero respawn allies zero I did do I didn't do anything in this game except talk and die and move a bit and loot. So use these advices, these advices, to hopefully do better than me. Also, don't forget to follow, like, subscribe to Scruffy Golem 196, a cool Twitch and YouTube gamer who does excellent FPS game gaming content that you're gonna love. Lastly, thank you so much for watching Apex Legend Beginner Hell. Hope I'm going to see you on my next videos. If you watched until this point. Subscribe to me as well, come on, you clearly find something in me, and that's great. Until my next video, bye bye.